What? Our mental health state goes down because... This doesn't make any sense. The mental health state does not make any sense. The mechanic is so stupid. <laughs> This guy has claws. Is this possessed man going to kill this person? Who the hell are you? The, the fuck fucking the ring girl or whatever? given us everything we asked for. There's no chance of him escaping. Okay, this is it. Everybody in position. Copy that. I'll go in first. You cover me. Okay. Holy shit, what the fuck? What the fuck? Damn, what the hell is this? This is Satan. Cover me. I'm gonna check the doors. Lucas, what the hell happened to your apartment, man? Turn back, Lucas. Put your hands in the air. <laughs> Damn, the police. What the fuck is he gonna do? I'll spend the rest of my days rotting in prison. What? Find out what, really happened. what is this? It's not gonna what is gonna happen? What the fuck is gonna happen? Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Um, oops, <laughs> awkward. And that's how my story ends. I felt a strange power within me, but I wasn't capable of using it at the right time oh. to get away from the cops. So I'll live out my days in the New York State Penitentiary. No, hold, hold on a second. What the fuck? Put your hands in the air. I only have one life. They already found me. I'll spend the rest of my days rotting in prison, and I'll never find out what really happened. No, it's not gonna happen like that. Okay, let's go, Lucas. <laughs> what the fuck? Lucas, where is this energy this whole time? Stop, bro, shoot. Don't move, <laughs> is he gonna fucking dodge? <laughs> 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 
<laughs> oh my god. This is the fucking Matrix. <laughs> New York police. Don't move. Oh my god, I'm trying hard not to mess up. <laughs> oh my god. What the fuck, man? Oh no. That's how my story ends. I felt a strange power within me, but I wasn't capable of using it at the right moment. I died trying to escape from the police. I'll never find out. You died? Well, how are you speaking? Put your hand in the air. Oh my god, this shit is so ridiculous. find out what really happened. It's not gonna happen like that. This dude wants to be in the Avengers so bad. Like, look at this. Fast reflexes. Possibly superhuman strength. Like, look at this. <laughs> Where was Lucas Kane when Thanos invaded Earth? This is so funny. But this is where I screwed up, I think. What the fuck, man? <laughs> <laughs> Bro! Is Tony Stark watching this? Put him on the Avengers. That guy just did? Shit, that's crazy. We need to catch him. Next time he won't get away. Oh, I can't wait for the D new Disney Plus series starring Lucas Kane. Holy shit. <laughs> that's what I'm this is this is why I'm here. This is what, what I'm here for, is this ridiculous, crazy ass plot. I'm here for it. All right, let's continue. Uh, I just have more time. All right, let's go. Five men in the hospital, four wrecked squad cars, a helicopter that just missed blowing up in our faces. Meanwhile, the killer takes a nice quiet ride on the subway. I hope there's a good explanation for all this. <laughs> uh, Carla, you explain this. Nothing went according to plan, Captain. The operation was set up by the book and everybody did their jobs, but Kane displayed some abnormal abilities. Just what are you trying to tell me here? That this guy is Superman? That's your excuse? And you seriously yeah. expect me to buy that crap? Uh, you, you live in New York, dude. 
Captain, we're not amateurs. If this guy was a tourist, we would have cuffed him and stuffed him in no time. We underestimated him. He's a lot more dangerous than we thought. I don't give a crap about your two-bit excuses. <laughs> if the press finds out the cane slipped through our fingers, they're gonna make me a laughingstock, and the mayor's gonna come looking for my head. Now, what is the plan, people? Are you on his trail? Yeah. Kane's photo will be in every squad car, train station, and airport. We're going over every inch of his apartment and interrogating his associates. He can't stay hidden forever. I want every available man on Kane's ass right now. I want him locked up tight in 48 hours or less. You understand me? I want this nut job behind bars before he decides to cut somebody else. Now get out of here! Well, to be fair, this game is set like before 2012, right? And that's when the Avengers Carla, happened. So, we found some of Kane's prints in an apartment where we found the dead body. He'll be there. Lady. He'll that's he'll be a, he'll be a part of the team. Murder last night in a lavamatic. One of the two victims was killed by knife blows to the heart. Garrett's already there. He's waiting for you. Uh. No, we gotta go to Lucas. We gotta go to Lucas. 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 Ooh, Agatha, she's alive. In the spirit realm. Okay. Show yourself. What do you want? Agatha, Agatha is that you? I, I thought you were... Dead. In a way. But I promise to tell you what I know. She's in the spirit but realm. I always keep my word. Listen carefully, Lucas. We have very little time. You are not insane. Neither are you a murderer. You are simply at the wrong place, at the wrong time. All right, who? Then who made me commit that murder? Who came and sat down at my table in the restaurant? No one knows his real name. They call him the Oracle. He serves the most powerful of the powerful. They Fucking God? Shadow. But they have controlled this world since the dawn of time. Uh... Murder? Why did they make me commit that murder? They've turned you into the instrument of a millennial sacrifice. It's a way for them to see what's hidden. They are looking for a little girl. They'll do anything to get her. Yeah, we've seen her. What's her purpose? They're coming. Save yourself, Lucas. They want your life. Kuetnitlan. In the ancient Mayan civilization. You'll find some of the answers you see. Oh, 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 what? <laughs> Agatha. Agatha. We went to the Mayans now? What the fuck is this game? <laughs> the Mayans, of course. This was all the Mayans all along. Why didn't I think of that? Oh god damn it. That's how my story ends. Officially they called it a suicide. I'd never find out the truth about the This one life bullshit. I screwed up previously. Bro, how did we go from a supernatural murder mystery to the Mayans? <laughs> I 
that's an escalation. Oh, come on. Oh. I'm always ready. Dude, what is this? What is the lore? The lore is gonna be fucking batshit crazy. The reason for all this supernatural shit. The Mayans are somehow involved. Oh, come on. These go on for way too long. Okay, we're done. Lucas, Thank God. Wake up. What are you doing here? What happened? The, the police found me. I managed to get away. I walked all night. I, I didn't have anywhere else to go, so I came here. My God. This time you really have to go to the police, Lucas. There is no other solution. I'm not turning myself in until I understand what happened. The Mayans. Agatha. I saw Agatha again. Here, just a while ago. She, she's dead, but she had some things to tell me. I, I think she wants to help me. Agatha is dead? Are you telling me that you... No, I didn't kill Agatha, Marcus. She was dead by the time I got there. But you're saying that you talked to a dead person? Yeah. None of this makes any sense. Powers. I'm a fucking mutant. Something strange is happening to me, Marcus. Since the murder, I, I'm I gifted. I do abnormal things. I see visions of certain events before they happen. Sometimes I can even hear what people are thinking. And my body has become much stronger and faster. Nobody has powers like that. You're not turning into a Superman, Lucas. Why does so ev what are you every media to? have to reference you Superman? The police will certainly come to question me, and probably place me under surveillance. I have to find some place to hide. I'm a fugitive. My description will go out everywhere. At least now I know that there is an explanation. I need to find the people who are behind all of this. The Mayans. <laughs> They'll kill you if you get a chance. <laughs> the fucking Nothing Mayans. Be worse than what I see in my visions. Agatha talked about the Mayans. It's vague, but it's all I've got to do. <laughs> I've got to find a place to hide while I figure this out. There's only one person who can help me. This is ridiculous. Minus five degrees Fahrenheit. I'm here for it. Every day it got a little colder. The whole city seemed to be numbed by the snow and ice. But nobody was worried about it. <clears throat> See. Go take a look inside, Tyler. I'm gonna talk to Garrett and see if he found anything. Cool with me. I can't even think out here in this damn cold. Ah, I was waiting for you, Carla. So, what happened here? The guy who runs the lab matic found the bodies around 5 o'clock this morning when he came to open up. When he tried to get in, it seemed like the door was blocked from the inside. 
He saw the two bodies through a window and called the cops. Trail? Were there any witnesses? No eyewitnesses. We checked around the neighborhood, but didn't turn up anything. This guy got lucky. He commits a double murder in front of a window, and nobody sees a thing. Clues. Were there any prints? Just those of the victims. No prints from Cain, if that's what you're wondering. Thanks, Garrett. Can I move? Okay. Honestly, I'm so down to replay Detroit Become Human and Heavy Rain. Maybe Beyond Two Souls, just cause... I don't know. David Cage has like... He has the mind of all minds when it comes to storytelling. And ideas. And choices. <laughs> and plot development. Three or four stabs in the area of the heart. Exactly like the victim in the restaurant. I wouldn't be surprised if the autopsy finds that the arteries were severed. Okay. I want to check on a thing or two before I leave. Did you notice this blood over here? Yeah, I saw that. Jesus, did he stab himself? That the murderer was bleeding before he stabbed his victim. Just like in the toilets of the restaurant. I don't think it's a good idea to walk all over the bloody footprints. A knife stuck in his eye. Death would have been instantaneous. Oh, the symbols. His wrists are all cut up. Looks like some kind of symbol carved on them. A snake. A snake with two heads. Okay. God, I'm so hungry right now. <clears throat> Probably eat something after this recording. I want to check on a thing or two before I leave. Does he have any thoughts? Knife is stuck in his eye. Damn, that's gotta hurt. Yes, I'm raising my mental health state. Poor girl, she was stabbed from the front. She found out who her killer was at the very last moment. Phone call. We can still hear the dial tone. She must not have had time to dial the number. Too bad, we could have had a live witness. Was there more? Here's the victim's laundry. Who would have believed she wouldn't be alive to get it out when he was ready? All right, I'm ready to leave. I want to check on a thing or two before I leave. Oh, what's this? Bizarre. Why is there blood here? Is this where he cut up his own forearms? Cain left some blood in the toilets, too. Did Cain cut his arms up, too?
The knife has the same handle as these other tools. It must have come from this toolbox. I think that's everything. Leave. Let's go. I've seen enough. What are we supposed to think about this murder? The guy committed suicide after killing the woman? It seems absurd, but it's the only explanation. I don't think Kane had anything to do with what happened at the Laundrette. But, all the same, there's got to be a link between the two murders. Alright, this is a good place to stop. Can't wait to play more.